<laughs> Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Guys, another new racket. There's just a bunch of new rackets coming out all the time, and everybody wants me to test these things. So I got something else for you now, too. Stay tuned. All right, guys. Morning, Cup of Joe. Thank you for everybody for supporting my Cup of Joe habit. Link network, buymeacoffee.com backslash tennis spin. Link is below. Thank you guys so much. So guys, Wilson brought back another fan favorite. The Pro Staff 6-1, 100. So I've, I barely remember this racket. I know it's popular among a bunch of a bunch of you guys. Um, There's one of the rackets I didn't, I didn't quite understand why they brought back, but uh, but I know from a lot of comments over the year that um, a lot of you love this racket. So I have one in my hand, and I'm gonna go over it real quick before stringing it. Um, 100 square inch head on a 6-1, 10.8 without strings, so that's 305. 12 points head light, obviously 27 inches, to 16 by 19 string pattern. Uh, I'm going to go over a little bit more of the details with you um, later on. I just strung it with a ALU power at 52 pounds, and I took off the plastic. Okay, so I think that's right on where it's supposed to be. Um, balance, as you can see by these two numbers, it is a little on the he head heavier side and pretty flexible. So I thought that racket was a little thinner from what I remember, but uh, maybe the black is making it thicker. Uh, 16 by 19 string pattern. The beam is 22.5. Constant beam, not tapered in any way. Look at this racket. I just want to, it looks very egg-like, kind of oval egg-like. Got the PWS on the sides. The 22.5. Maybe it's the black that's throwing me off. Um, I don't remember it being this thick. Maybe I'm thinking about a different bracket, but they call it 13 Pro Staff 61. So uh, I've, you know, I remember a racket similar to this in white. So, uh, but I'm sure this is an old remake of something. Okay, so let's try it out. We'll see you on the court. So on the court, nice cold night. Coach Goo gonna be wearing his warm jacket. Uh, yep. I got the Pro Staff 100, 61100 version. What is this? 13, 16 by 19. All right. I actually don't think I ever hit with one of these before, but there's a first for everything. Okay, Coach Goo, we ready? Yep. Let's I guess so. Oh, Lord. All right, so we just got off the court. Pro staff, 6-1-100. Coach Goo, have you ever seen a racket like this before? No, I think this is the first time I've ever seen a 100 on a pro staff, ever. I um, feel like me too, but I'm going to let you review. Go for it, man. Um, overall, I'm actually pretty shocked at how this felt. Um, when you first hold it, it actually feels pretty balanced out. Um, when I was swinging around with this racket, it reminded me of the Yonex 95 V-Core. Not the current version, not with the blue paint on the side. It was the old version. It was the one I, I used to play with. And it actually had that same feeling. It kind of had the same like thickness right here too. So like the throw is like kind of similar to the uh, B495. Even though it's a little shorter, it's still a long throat. Um, when you hit through the shot, it actually felt the whole racket kind of the whole weight shift throughout the whole head. 
and it actually felt really smooth. Um, it delivers like the pro staff. Uh, I feel like if I feel like it has a bigger sweet spot compared to the other ones. Um, easier access to power. Um, actually has a decent amount of feel um, for a hundred square inches. So overall, really impressed with this racket. And if you're a pro staff and you want a bigger sweet spot, this is the one for sure. Whoa, that's high praise for Coach Goo. Um, I know exactly what he's talking about. Um, when we reviewed that V-Core 95, the old version, which was the all red version as he's talking about. The one I used, correct. Yes, um, I know what he means. When you get this racket moving, as it gets closer to impact, the weight shifts into the head. And when it shifts into the head at impact, you feel like the whole mass of the racket is at the ball. Mm -hmm. So it was actually easy to swing this racket. It's, it's, it's perfectly weighted and balanced. And it was stiff enough where you could actually hammer the ball uh, when you wanted to. I and feel like actually um, the flex, the flex, you know how the 95, old 95 was more flexible, mm -hmm. even though like, it's a stiffer, it still like made it still go through, but it was more solid. I actually preferred this one. But this is a constant beam. That is true. This that is, is a true. constant beam. Whereas the, the 95 was a slightly more tapered beam. Yeah, that's so true. So it was th thinner at the top from what I remember. It thickened yeah, up over here. Yeah, it was here. thinner, yeah. So, it was thinner on the top. So it, it was yeah. meant to bend a little more. Whereas this one, I was actually pretty shocked at how stiff this racket was. But um, it felt good. But it, it felt, felt really, really good. good. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, the slice was actually really easy to let go yeah. of. Before, right? like the slices on the pro stuff, you kind of have to like go after it. Even going after it, it was like so small the sweet spot that like it, it couldn't go through if you didn't hit it right. But like this is actually like easy to slice, easy to go around corners if you had to on the run. It's a solid racket. So like for me to have a hundred on a pro staff and have like this type of beam, I'm really surprised with this racket. Yep, I think the extra three square inches and uh, took a little bit of weight off of it. Uh, yeah, because it's a 305 without the strings. It's almost uh, like a blade, basically. Yeah, made it made it almost perfect. So I definitely recommend this racket. Um, I definitely too. say if you're a pro staff user and you never heard of this and you want to dial in a little more power. Uh, that light is too light for you in the 97. That this 11 one. ouncer is too uh, heavy. heavy for you. This is actually a perfect balance. This is the one. Yeah. yeah. It's the perfect so, balance. So, Pro Staff 6 1, 100. 16 by 19. 16 by 19. We just heard of it. Hopefully, you guys know about it. But if you haven't heard about it, hey, time to buy one. All right. I want to thank my man, Coach Goo, for uh, testing out this racket with me today. Where can we find you, Goo? You can find me at agu.tennis. I'll also be posting content there as well. All right. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.